Witch. For those that don't know me, my name is Connie, and if you're new to my channel, I'd like to welcome you. And if you are new, let me know in the comments down below. Let me know how you found out about my channel, and let me know a little bit about yourself so I can start to get to know you better. So how are all my Yorny aliens doing today? I hope y'all are having an amazing day. So today's video is Knitting Friday. So I am going to show you the progress of my temperature blanket. And today the temperature averaged in the 70s. So this is how it's coming along. And I'm also going to let y'all see a picture of, of the biscuit holding up the blanket so y'all can see it better. So take it away, Frank. getting y'all biscuit fix a lot lately <laughs> so anyway I completed the sock monkey beanie that I was working on and it's the beanie that I'm wearing and this is how it came out and I just think it's so so cute I love sock monkeys and I'm curious do y'all like sock monkeys let me know in the comments down below if you like them and now I'm going to let y'all see a picture of the beanie so y'all can see it better. So I'll be back in just a minute. So the Sock Monkey Beanie is a pattern that I purchased off of Ravelry. But unfortunately, the pattern is no longer available there. And I even tried looking at the seller's page and the seller's not there either. And I tried looking on Ravelry too and I had no luck finding the pattern that I used. So unfortunately, I won't be able to share this pattern with y'all. And I did start on another project. And this is going to be Sock Monkey Fingerless Gloves. I haven't gotten real four with the first glove yet, but this is how it's looking so far. And I found the pattern off of Ravelry. And I am doing mine a little different from how the pattern is, but I will put the link for the pattern in the description box of this video in case any of y'all are interested in making sock monkey gloves. And I'm also curious, what are y'all currently knitting? Let me know in the comments down below. So, I know I had told y'all I would be working on a tutorial for a striped beanie. And I did start working on the tutorial. And unfortunately, my camera, you know how when you tilt your cell phone, how the camera changes the view? Well... It ended up filming from the vertical view. So I'm going to have to re refill most of what I did. Luckily, I wasn't real four on the tutorial. But I will be working on that this coming week. So hopefully, I get, I get a good bit of the tutorial done. I don't know if I'll have it finished for you by the end of next week or not. But I will be working on it so that it will be coming. So now we're going to get into the announcements. So tomorrow, which is Saturday, I will be going live at 12.30 p.m. Central Standard Time. And Amber Allen will be my guest star. So I hope y'all can make it to that live. We're going to have a lot of fun. Also, I know... Nor I, I know... I normally do my shout out videos the second Thursday of the month and I haven't gotten to make the shout out video yet. It is coming. I'm going to try to work on it tomorrow after my live. So hopefully I can get it to you tomorrow. And also my finished objects video. I have started working on that today and it will be that video should be uploaded 
probably this evening so that video is coming and I just want to say I love seeing all of the finished project pictures that y'all send in y'all just have so much talent and I just find it so inspiring seeing y'all pictures and I think this video that that I'll be putting out later today I think this is the most pictures I've ever gotten for a finished objects video I have about 70 pictures in this that's gonna be in this video so like I said be on the lookout for that video this evening and then the next finished objects video will be on May 15th so if y'all have any finished projects that y'all finish in the next month, take a picture, email it to me at justanotherstitch2020 at gmail.com and I'll put your picture in the next finished objects video. So I think that pretty much covers everything. So let's get into cat news. news today. Well, I don't have a lot of cat news for y'all today, unfortunately. Um, now, Allie, Allie was so cute the other day. Frank comes home from a delivery, and Allie goes on her hind la legs looking out the screen, the, uh, screen door, and as Frank approaches, she's just meowing at him. It was just so sweet. And other than that, Allie's basically just been finding little cubby holes. She's been finding some new spots to sleep or relax in. Allie loves her cubby holes. Um, and Sophie, Sophie really hasn't done that much. She basically still still enjoying the wound care boxes. She likes sleeping and relaxing on top of them. And at night, you know, she does her little love moments where she jumps on my back and makes biscuits on me. Um, and she plops in my chair sometimes when I'm crocheting or knitting and does the same thing. But that's pretty much all they've been doing the last few days. Um, so anyway, I hope y'all are having a fabulous yarny day. Be the light and bye!